This is a, uh, a little message to the uh, real atheist, uh, not the fake ones who actually uh, uh, cuddle with this Sharia death cult who want to kill you. Now, this guy, in the video that I added, there is this atheist guy who actually uh, opened uh, his actually channel, some kind of actually uh, uh, place a chat where he was talking about the Sharia debt cult. And these other the Zumanians actually joined them. And they actually uh, started basically listening to what he was talking. I think they were probably among atheists. So this guy, the, so the, the, the atheist, this, this atheist talks in Zubali. There's another one. There's many of these actually Zumanians, but the bulk of the motherfuckers are clicked with the Sharia cult. Don't let them fool you. Many of these motherfuckers are clicked with the Sharia cult because their families are still Sharia cult. But there is a few who are not clicked who literally basically call uh, a, spade, a spade and called this uh, Sharia dead call to what it is. And so that this guy opened uh, basically a channel where he was talking about that. And the Zumalians actually came in. I think he invited them. I don't know how it works, but in any case, you have to pull these people in. And so they didn't like what he was actually talking about. And many of these Zumalians who actually came into the channel were Christians. Many of these fuckers are also Christians. It's not only atheists, but it's also Christians. And they actually, uh, and so in there, he basically uh, insulted Muhammad. And all the Sharia death cults actually went crazy, as they usual. That, that's, they, they go crazy. Uh, but what is interesting is that the Christian ones also went crazy. And it's actually the Christian one who was actually threatening, actually, uh, this actually atheist. The, the other ones are also uh, threatening him. And he says, you know, they're calling him basically from different, many of these motherfuckers, Mahalud and Sharmut, are in, and, uh, refugees in, the, in Europe, in, we in the West. And so he's like, the, the atheist guy is like, I'm, I'm receiving all these actually, uh, uh, basically, death actually uh, threats from these actually uh, uh, basic countries, Sweden, uh, Denmark, uh, Denmark. Uh, I think he mentioned Greece. So he's, he's like the atheist guy is like, oh, they threatened me from all these actually places. But there is also a Christian one who says, uh, um, I don't believe in Islam. And so the, the atheist the guy says, I don't believe in the Bible. That's what he's actually responding to the Christian. One. I don't believe in the Bible. and I don't believe in the Quran. That's what he says. And he tells the Muslims, uh, fuck your prophet. And so the Muslims, as their Sharia death call to actually uh, uh, usual, uh, uh, basically, uh, uh, manners, they go after, they threaten him. But what is interesting is that the Christian ones also basically joins them and tells him, uh, I'm threatening you in the name of humanity. I kid you not, that's what he says. He's like, my father is actually praying right now. Uh, he says, you know, the uh, Qiyamah uh, lay basically like the, 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 the prayer of the uh, supplication to Allah. That's what he's telling him. And I'm... I'm going to kill you in the name of uh, basically humanity. I kid you not, that's what he tell, tells him. And one of them is also that Zumanian who was actually uh, supposed to be an atheist and then who became a Christian, Kahadin. She's also in there. She's the one telling the atheist to actually close his, uh, his actually uh, room. So they're telling him to close the room. And it's like, no, I opened this room to actually talk about uh, this actually uh, Sharia cult. And so uh, you have to understand, for the atheists, I want to tell you this. Just a, uh, uh, this is a Zumalian guy who's called the Abdi uh, Freedom or some shit. He's a, he's a Darod. He's actually the one. He's a, a homosexual, uh, basically, uh, Darod. And he's the one who actually, some say he's the one who owns that website, that Zumali spot that the Darod actually run. And he sometimes, I think at one time he was claiming a Christian. I think he's a Christian. I don't think, I don't think he's an atheist. I think he's a Christian. Uh, I, at some point he had the Christian cross, uh, you know, uh, many of these motherfuckers are trolls, but I think this motherfucker is a Christian. I don't think he's a Muslim. Uh, he's a Christian. And he actually uh, saying in here that a lot of these Zumalian Christians are actually brought from basically Ethiopia and Kenya by these Christian church organizations. And remember, many of these motherfuckers are like this fucker. This mother, they are hardcore, basically Sharia cult. Many of these Mahanud and Sharmutas are not actually real Christians. Some of them will go to these places because it's very tough to actually, uh, basically immigrate to these actually Western countries. They have people have to cross the desert. They have to go to Libya where they get raped. I talked about these Zumadians getting raped in Libya, and so many of these motherfuckers will opt to actually go into these churches, learn about Christianity, and then, uh, basically 
basically pretend to be Christian and they are brought basically in in the West by these churches bring them. But many of these motherfuckers also convert to Christianity because they were brought up in Christian in, in Christianity. But their Sharia cult nature doesn't change. I kid you not, they, they will kill you for the Sharia cult because they are clicked. To, these motherfuckers are called Abrahamia. Just a, so this is a listen to this guy. This is a a guy called J Smith. He's an evangelical Christian. He's talking to here one of his evangelical actually friend. This motherfucker J Smith has a big channel. The the, the biggest actually uh, uh proselytizers actually that you can find in YouTube. Him and basically uh, um all these Christians, the Hatun and uh, uh, basically that David Wood. All these motherfuckers. Listen to what this motherfucker says about the Muslims who wanted to kill him. He he. he I posted the, the audio, the, the, you know, uh, the, 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 um, um, the little excerpt uh, on my, actually, in the video list, in my, actually, in, in, in the page. You can actually scroll through and check it. Here is a little excerpt of that excerpt. Got beat up. I got thrown off the ladder. You can see where they try to open up my throat here. Uh, they, I, a number of my... I, uh, yeah, was, tell, that, tell that story what happened where they tried to cut <clears> your throat. I don't want to tell that story. Okay. I want to tell another story. Because this is what really this is what really underlines what's happening. I was on a ladder. You guys once. need to ask him at lunch that story. It's a good story. <clears throat> I was on a. I was on a. There was a guy named Muhammad, and his like many of them are named. And he was about six foot seven. He was on the ground, so his face was right next to mine when he was standing on the ground. And I was going on about Muhammad, and at that time I was going through the traditions on Muhammad, going back to the source material on his life, what he did, what he said, things like that, and just trashing him because of of his. The fact that he's just not relevant for the, for the 21st century. And this Muhammad just grabbed me and threw me off the ladder, and I went flying. I went this way, my glasses went this way. Got back up, put my glasses back on, got, got on the ladder again, and started again. Three minutes later, he grabs me and throws me that way. And I brushed myself off, got back on the ladder, started a third time. And right again, he grabbed me, and he just threw me to the ground and it you know it's painful to fall to the ground and I was bruised and I was cutting up as I was about ready to get back on the ladder again this Irish fellow who's an atheist well-known atheist down there comes up to the two of us and says why are you two talking to each other it's obvious you hate each other Muhammad put his arm around me turned towards the Irish man and says this man believes in God I believe in God you don't <laughs> this man believes in heaven and hell I believe in heaven and hell you don't this man is my brother. Who are you? That said it right there. Here is a guy who had thrown me off the ladder three times, yet called me his brother. And for the rest of the world who doesn't understand what's going on here, this is something that, that where the penny drops for me. You can this is what he says about a, the, uh, the Muslim. Remember, he says the Muslim wanted to kill him when he went to actually to these actually uh, British, to these actually uh, what, what it's called, the speaker's corner where he actually he preaches or he actually, you know, tries to actually uh, confront these Muslims about uh, the, the basically Islam and Muhammad and their history. They wanted to kill this fucker. They wanted to slice his actually ayora. It's basically his, 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 his vein like they did to Hatun. They, they almost killed Hatun. They wanted to kill. He says that in the video. He's like, oh, they wanted to kill me. They wanted to slice my actually, uh, you know, the, my vein, he says, on my neck. But then listen to what this motherfucker, this Christian motherfucker, this devil spawn, what he says about the Muslims. He says there is a, 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 a an Irish atheist and a Muslim, actually, uh, the Muslims who wanted to kill him. Between these two, he says his brother is the Muslim guy. He's the Muslim guy. The motherfuckers who wanted to slice his fucking throat, that's, he, that's, that's the one he says he, who, uh, he's his brother. So I'm telling you, if he's Romanian atheist, do, this motherfucker, this Christian motherfuckers, these devil motherfuckers are no different than the Sharia cult. Don't let them fool you. Don't let that fucking apostate prophet and David Wood fucking companionship that you see online joking and shit, you know, you know uh, fool you. These motherfuckers are no different than that fucking uh, Sharia death cult. The motherfuckers, they, they, they are the fucking same. Don't let them, don't fucking trust these fucking Christian motherfuckers. If you live in the US and uh, uh, and you actually, like even Christian prince, they, when this Sharia cult to go to Christian prince, they threaten. They threaten him. So if you live in, the, in, in, in Europe, you have to be on basically on your actually guard. 
every any fucking sharia dead cult or any fucking christians you have to watch yourself don't let these motherfuckers actually you know uh catch you uh, sleeping especially them fucking sharia called the muslims the zumanian mahnud and sharmuta are actually the ones that you have to watch because you will fucking kick with these fuckers but i'm telling you they are they are the same if you're in the u.s christian press is trapped practice your first amendment strap yourself and if these motherfuckers actually threaten you shoot these motherfuckers on your side on sight stand your ground don't let them fucking uh basically uh scare the scare you and remember these fuckers are clicked just because you're in uh, basically in the west don't believe these fucking christian motherfuckers uh, are pacifists and shit no they prefer that muslim one because it's an abraham it's an abraham it's an aryan alien fucking cult that's what abraham is they fucking clicked that's the message for the for the atheists